I got my first gift and it comes from Cross Thread Embroidery. Stay tuned to find out what it is. Greetings. Welcome to our channel. I'm Eve with The Baby's Booty. The day before yesterday, I posted a video about our Facebook group challenge. It's called the Gift Challenge. The Gift Challenge is essentially, um, I send a gift to those who wish to participate in the challenge. Um, and the gift had to be something in regards to embroidery, uh, the field that we're in. It could be sewing notions, it could be embroidery blanks, it could be um, notions such as needles or a stabilizer, or it could be thread. It could be anything that has something to do with our business. And it helps for if I had extras of something and it would allow me to de-stash or get rid of the extras that I had on hand um, and present it to another member as a gift. I mean, as a, a, a gift for them to use with their business. Now, the catch with it was not really a catch, but the opposite is once that person receives a gift, they send a gift back to you. So it's a trust system, a lot of fun because you don't know what you're going to get. Um, and I, I think I thought that was a really cool idea. And it was presented to our group by the group uh, leader, which is Candia Hainsworth. She started our Facebook group called Embroidery Boss. I am making this video today in follow up to the video that I made two days ago about uh, the gift challenge. And I picked five names in my video. However, yesterday when I went to my P.O. box, I found an envelope and I'm like, who is this? I don't remember ordering anything, um, which I'm notorious for ordering stuff online. But in this instance, I wasn't sure. So I happened to think and I'm like, oh my God, it has to be a gift already. And I'm pretty sure it is. So I'm kind of excited. I'm actually very excited because I'm pretty sure this is a gift. And I wanted to open it and let you guys share my excitement because I haven't opened it yet. So I don't know what it is. And I'm, I'm really psyched about this and it's really cool. And I'm sorry if I'm being repetitive, but I'm just like really excited. Um, I've already bought the envelopes for my gifts. My gifts are going out today. As a matter of fact, the only thing I have to do is print the labels for them. So if you're one of the five people, be on the lookout. And surprise, I'm sending one to an extra person. How cool is that? So... Um, hopefully you guys will enjoy what I sent. So that was, it's kind of tough to do it because you, you don't know what a person may need or what a person may want. They may not like what you send. Um, uh, but the thing is I'm going to be sending it to them anyway. So hopefully they'll like it and appreciate it. Meanwhile, let's get to my gift. So I get to my mailbox and I find this lovely little gem here and I don't want to show her address, but I'm really excited. So we're going to open this up and see exactly what this is. And this is from Miss Pamela Pittman out of Oregon. Wow. This package came a long way across country to get to me. So Miss Pittman, I want to let you know, I am so excited this was my first gift and it was like a really big pick me up when i actually thought about it and was like oh my god is that what this is and i was really excited um and i wanted to make a video last night but i wasn't feeling my best so i didn't make the video last night and i had to take some allergy medicine so today i'm feeling great and i'm going to open it now so let's see what miss Pittman sent me isn't this so cool and exciting Open this sucker right on up. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Several things. Oh, it's two things. Cool. Miss Pam Pittman, owner designer of Cross Thread Embroidery. Oh, it looks like a, a, a little purse. Oh, that is so cool. Oh, it's a kitty cat. <laughs> Look how adorable. And it's got a little zipper pull with this a, a little fish. Isn't that neat? This is so cute. Oh my God. I love little purses and knickknacks. That's so neat. Oh, cool. So it's cushioned. I can put all kinds of cool stuff in it. Um, knowing me, I'll probably put my change in it because I, I'm notorious for having change flying throughout my purse. So, and I needed a change purse. And it's got a little keychain 
thing on it, which I'm not allowed to put anything else on my keychain. My husband is adamant about that. I have enough, but I can clip it to my purse. So this is gonna clip to the side of my purse and sit on the inside and I'm gonna put my change in it. How cool is this? Oh, thank you. This is really cool and I love Kit Kats. So I have one, even though I'm allergic to him, we're not gonna talk about that, but I love him very much and he's in my home anyway. So thank you. And there were two things in here actually. So let's see what the other thing was. Oh, it says needles, cool. See, oh my God, this is so cool. I like getting stuff, this is so cool. Oh, cool. It's a needle hole. Oh, neat, neat, neat. Okay, so I can take my needles and I can stick them in here and it'll hold my needles. Oh, that is so thoughtful. Gosh, because right now my needles are just sitting on the magnetic bar. I don't like have them in anything except for just the little chewing gum looking wrapper and they're just stuck to the magnetic bar. So this is gonna be actually cooler to put my needles in and it says needles. So anyone will know where my needles are. Thank you. Oh my God, Miss Pittman, this was awesome. This was awesome. I really appreciate it. Um, I, I really did need something to put my needles in. So this is going to work out great. And these were my first two gifts. A needle holder and a little change purse. How cool was that? So again, um, that was from Miss Pamela Pittman. And she is with Embroidery cross stitches so if you are interested in doing business with her um she should be on facebook she should be on facebook but if you have any questions give me a call and i'll refer you to her so if you're in oregon um near estacada estacada oregon if you're near that area and you need embroidery work done shoot me a message and I'll refer you directly to her if you want to get an order to her and be able to pick it up locally instead of having it shipped. I'm sure she'll be more than happy to accommodate you. Um, Miss Pittman, if I'm wrong about that, let me know as well and I'll um, correct that. But for right now, um, she is awesome. You see her work is gorgeous. She does embroidery in the hoop work and she makes the little kitty cat purses and she makes a needle holder so if you're interested in either one of these or anything else for that matter dealing with embroidery give her a call or contact me and i'll refer you to her rather so thank you this is gift video number one yay and i'm about to send out my gifts i'm really excited about that so you guys be on the lookout for your gifts like i said they're going out in the mail today so i'm really psyched about this and i look forward to it and please give me feedback let me know what you thought about your gift hopefully you'll like it i try to make it useful i try to make it something that you would use so hopefully everyone will be okay with it meanwhile if you do embroider again if you do embroidery and you do it for business or you do it for pleasure you are more than welcome to contact candia hainsworth of candia hainsworth designs either you can look up she has a website candia hainsworth uh, com, or you can go to facebook and look up embroidery boss and we will be more than happy to review your information see if you fit the criteria to join the Facebook group so that you can be in on our next gift challenge because we do have some other challenges coming up here shortly. Um, otherwise, I will have a link at the end to easily subscribe to my channel. I tend to ramble a little bit, uh, but I like to have fun. Um, and I also do other video tutorials on things dealing with embroidery, embroidery designs, um, as well as some slight sewing type videos so if you're interested in that please hit subscribe I'm, I'm loving the fact that i have so many people that are willing to subscribe to me i really appreciate it and from the bottom of my heart i'm just grateful um as well as hit like if you want to come back and get 
a quick reference to who sent me this, Miss Pittman out of Oregon, please like the video. And that way you can come right back to it and get her name or get my contact information to get in contact with her so that you can give Miss Pittman some business because she makes really cute things. So I look forward to hearing from you guys if you have any questions or any suggestions for videos. Um, and until next time, happy embroidering. Please click here to subscribe to our channel. Also, you may click here to go to Candia Hainsworth's channel. And this is one of our most recent videos that we've posted that you should find interesting. Thank you.